much. Who was like, what's going on? Good morning. So Ricardo is right now in the shower and I have his clothes ready, they're ironed. At his job, they're having a crock pot and he asked me to make the buffalo, the chicken buffalo ranch dip, is that what it's called? Or the chicken dip, that's what we just call it, the chicken dip. Um, he's like, can you please make it for me? So I was like, of course, so I just had to get it ready. It is eight in the morning right now, <clears throat> or a little past eight. Um, and I'm gonna get ready to go downstairs and work out, but I'm gonna wait till he leaves. Um, so I can say goodbye to him. And then this is a chicken that I had shredded. Um, so yeah, this is the hot sauce that I used. In a previous vlog, I showed you guys how to make this. It is amazing, and I wonder if they're gonna like it. I hope they do. Ricardo, that just came out of the shower. You guys, I'm such a dork. Yesterday when I was with Alex, we found these lights, and I was like, yes! I remembered to get light bulbs for our lamps because these are our new lamps, and I'm so in love with them. I just haven't taken off the price tag, and I still haven't, like, um plug them in so I am super excited old people problems we get excited about lamps <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and put these on there and yeah I'm super excited how my little side is coming along I want to decorate it a little bit more and I still have to like make our bed I tried working out this morning on my treadmill and that thing is a power machine. I couldn't believe how fast it was going. Usually when I'm at the gym, I always put it to the highest setting is six. And then if I feel extra, I don't know, energetic, then I'll switch it up to seven um, on the speed level. And I feel like every single time that I go to the gym, that's what I can go up to. Well, this time I tried putting it up to six and I was dying. And I don't know if it's because I'm extremely out of shape. I haven't ran in such a long time time but before when I used to put it that high regardless of how much time in between it was that I went to the gym I could always keep up up to six up to level six and this time I couldn't so I just think that maybe my treadmill is a little is newer than those machines and maybe like it's just extra fast I don't know it's a really good treadmill I was very very impressed but I need to like relax. I was so dizzy afterwards and I felt really sick to my stomach. Alex called me um, and I was like, girl, I can't even talk. I, I feel nauseous. I had to take a shower. Now I am just filming a room tour for you guys and I'll show you guys like what's in our side drawers and how I decorated um, because it just, I don't know, I'm super excited. It turned out really, really cute and I also want to include some DIYs and even though it's close to Christmas, I still want to share those DIYs with you guys because they're are going to be useful especially after getting all those Christmas cards you can still keep them displayed and then I keep up my Christmas decorations out for another month after Christmas so maybe until like the end of January I will take them down so I have my decorations out for a really really long time and you can also use them the next year as well so I'm super excited to share that with you guys I just got done filming the intro and outro for that. I filmed the um, the room tour and now I have to go to Joanne's or Michael's and get some supplies for the DIY projects. I thought I had all the supplies, but I'm like, you know what? I still need a couple of things more and I should probably go and get them now. I also want to stop by Target and get some lights for the DIY project. I hope it goes good, fingers crossed. And I need to make sure that, um, yeah, I don't forget anything on my list. By the way, this is what I'm wearing. I'm in my PJs and I have like a nice top on top, you know, cause that's what I do. Um, I really like this lipstick by the way. It is Ruby Boo from MAC. Um, it's also like my go-to lipstick when I want like a red lip and I don't want it to budge or move or do anything. But it is really drying on the lips. I'm not gonna lie, it's extremely drying. By the end of the day, like, my lips will be cracked. Um, Ricardo promised me movie night tonight. He's like, we can cuddle and have popcorn and just be on the couch. And then he texted me and he was like, baby, can my friends come over? And I was like, of course. Like, I couldn't say no. So I'm like, of course. I'm like, but you still owe me a cuddle date with popcorn. He's like, of course, of course. Um, but any chance that he gets to be with, a fr with his friends, I want to encourage that because, um, you know, it's now that we're older, I feel like 
we have jobs, we're busy. I will see him every single day. I mean, I, you know, I sleep with him at night. I wake up to him every morning and I see him a lot, a lot of the day. He comes home like at a reasonable time from work. So I have him all to myself all those times. So whenever he has time to be with his friends, we all have busy lives, like I said, I will gladly, um, you know, make sure that I move my plants in order for him to be with his friends because, like I said, it's not easy to make time when you're older and you have, like, a job. Um, and I'm sure everybody understands that, like, that's around my age or if you have a job or you just feel so busy or even if you have kids, you don't have time to see friends all the time. Fortunately, I have a job where I work from home, so I'm pretty much available when my friends are, are available if I'm not working or filming or anything like that. But, you know, we have to remember that with our spouses, our boyfriends, or, you know, whatnot, whatnot, with um, our partners, that we have to let them have friendships and let them have fun and let them, you know what I'm saying? I don't know, I'm going on like this long rant or rave or rant. What am I saying about it? On a spiel about it. Before I forget, look who's back. I found this phone case, I was looking for it, and I'm like, yes, I found it! It's Mr. Gingerbread. I don't know what to name him. You guys should help me name him. Hey, guys. So, ow, 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 my... Okay, my purse is pulling my hair. I am at Joanne Fabrics right now, and I'm looking for um, buttons, and I'm also looking to... I'm also looking at the fabric, and I'm looking at these right here. These are super cute. I'm going to make my nephew a blanket for Christmas. And I wasn't sure if I should have it polka dots or Mickey Mouse. So I think I'm just going to do both. I think Ricardo's calling me. So I was calling him earlier. Yep. Hello? Hey. I did. I want to let you know that I'm not home, that I'm at Joanne Fabrics. I'm at Joanne Fabrics. I need to get some stuff for my DIY video. Okay. I'll let you... I'll be home soon. I'm not going to take long. Okay, love you. Mwah. Bye, baby. Yeah, so I want these two. I didn't know if I wanted, like, just Mickey. I don't know if you could see him. He's right here. Mickey or, like, the polka dots. I couldn't find anything cuter. I'm kind of disappointed because I want it blanket to be really cute and I don't want him to just have it for a little bit I want him to have it for a long time let me put the gingerbread man away um look at all this oh my gosh this is crazy but I love this purse by the way put down my camera yeah so I'm looking for buttons fabric glue I also need some fabric and I think I'm almost done Okay, so this is where the fabric glue is. I want to share it with you guys. This is what it looks like. It says fabric glue sticks, and you could use this like a hot glue gun, and you could just insert these sticks right here, and you can sew pretty much anything with this, and it stays, it stays pretty well, so it's a good glue, though it's kind of pricey in my, in my opinion, but you know what? It's worth it, so... I have a coupon and I feel like I always have a coupon anyway so it's gonna be worth it so we'll put that there so we are in my basement now and I set up this blanket so that could be like the backdrop or the background to it and then I have my lights right there Coco's right there Coco you don't you know you're not supposed to be down here go upstairs and then we have the camera and then we have what I bought today Coco so Ginger loves being in front of the camera she loves taking pictures come on Ginger let's show them yeah, you get it. And the cordos are here. Okay. They're letting me shoot while they're entertained. Go ahead, Ginger. Go over there. Go ahead. Go over there. Ooh, good girl. Sit. Ginger, don't come your booty. Oh, he's a good girl. Oh, yes. Work it. Work it. Work it. <laughs> Oh yes. Look at me, look at me. Pose, pose. Mm-hmm. Good girl. <laughs> box, 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 box. Oh, you're so good. You're such a good girl. You want to do it again? High five. Good girl. Good job. High five. Thank you. <laughs> Go 
don't go. Do you wanna pose for me? Go ahead, come here. No, look at her, she's like, I will do it all day long, mom. Ooh, okay, good girl, there you go.